Whenever I think about the theme of time, space, existence, a number of things come to mind. The buildings that we as architects create, the spaces inside and outside these buildings, and the time involved in these endeavors. Looking at buildings, I really believe quality buildings bring a special kind of life to a city. These buildings create spaces that are forever associated with that city. People who visit these spaces view them through the lens of the indoor space experience, but also more often than not they imagine themselves in the space. Time is something we have tried to understand for millennia. That is where the modern architect is trying to step in we must try to create natural spaces that allow its inhabitants to naturally observe the passage of time and be blessed by it. I firmly believe that, and it is in the process of capturing time, that life can gain extra meaning. Moving from town to space, I believe many architects forget to base their projects on the specific needs of the owner. These needs also must be combined with a living natural environment. When I create projects, I always try to combine my own experience with that of the owner to create a unique project. A component of the natural environment is light. We have a simple experiment to demonstrate the theme of our discussion today. As you can see, the structure of the external frame in the experiment is an analogy for the core of the building. The solid square represents the part of the building that is opened in order to connect with the outer space. We have inserted cubes of different sizes that represent furniture objects and the people in the space. An external ambient light source moves just as time moves in real life. The shadows are displaced between the surface of the block and the small pieces inside. This effect makes us aware of the real existence of these objects, which in turn reminds us to slow down and appreciate the beauty around us. Society is changing at even greater pace than ever before. We as architects need to keep up with these changes. So I look forward to the use of different design methods to create a space for humans filled with worlds and nature. I want to preserve the existence of humanity in buildings and stay away from left these structures. <laughs>